Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I have a quick project to share with you. Yes, this is a janky video. I'm doing it from the hotel room in Utah. I'm at a retreat, but had to share this with you. So this is what I'm giving in my swap. Um, it's just a trifold folio and I have used um, this style before, so I will link that in the description. And I used, it was two different, um, let me see, Frank Garcia. One was, if I could find it, um, Dolce. Most of it is Dolce. And then one I think was like the Magic Collection, the kind of Disney inspired. But our theme is Carnival. So yeah, this lighting's gonna be really bad. So sorry about that, y'all. But. I just, I wanted to share this with you really quick. So it looks like this here, have that. And Dolce, I think, I don't even know because it's in French, but I think it's in French. Um, <laughs> it is, um, I think it's like, a, I don't know, it's like desserts, but it says like love and everything on there. So, but it had all like the cute carnival looking stuff, all the rides. So I used it, you know, because I wanted something different just in case everybody else was using the same, you know, like current graphic 45 carnival collection. I just wanted, you know, of course to be a little different. So I have a little flap here and then it opens up like this. And I have just inside the pocket so cute this little bingo card that has nothing to do with a carnival but it had bling on it and it was cute and i couldn't help it and then just a little photo mat i did here before i glued this piece down onto my mat i um just fussy cut around the little kind of card thing i don't know what three and a half d means so maybe someone out there knows and then i just made a couple photo mats here a couple flowers from my stash and then you do have a waterfall, just really basic waterfall with a magnetic closure. This pulls out, this is from the Magic Collection. I do know that. And then it opens up like this, like this is from the Magic. All like the little ephemera pieces are from the Magic. So I only had like, oh my gosh, I think maybe five pieces of the um, Dolce. So I didn't have a lot to work with, but I think it turned out cute. I don't know, let me know. I do feel kind of bad because I like messed up, of course, on a couple things and you know, I'm gifting this and it's not perfect. So sorry, whoever gets this, <laughs> oops. And now I'm not gonna be able to get this out, watch. Oh my gosh, I knew this was gonna happen. Okay, so there's a little ephemera piece there. I'm kind of doing this at an angle, so it's a little weird. Just used a border punch and I did um, mat with like a, a kind of mint green that I have in my stash and then a foil, silver foil cardstock. I inked the edges with um, antique linen from Tim Holtz and of course I didn't have it all finished when I got to Utah so I came to finish it and I forgot that ink. So your girl had to MacGyver like no, nobody's business because it was late when I figured it out. I had to hurry up and finish this. And so I had a yellow highlighter in my bag and I had an extra sponge. I put that yellow highlighter on the sponge, put a little bit of the um, vintage photo on there. <laughs> I, you know, you just, you work with what you have. So I'm sorry, whoever gets this, I hope you like it, but you know, it's not perfect. And I know, so I'm so sorry. But there you guys go. Um, just a quick project share to show the trifold folio that I'm doing for a swap for Country Craft Creations uh, Carnival Retreat here in Utah. So there you go. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. So that way you can see future projects. Thanks for watching. Bye.